Hello and welcome to Blue Lab's video on how to calibrate Blue Lab's pH pen. Remove your pen from the box. Remove cap carefully by pulling it back and forth. You'll need to hydrate the pH pen before its first use. Fill a plastic container with Blue Lab pH probe KCL storage solution so the pH probe tip will be fully submerged. Place the pH pen upright in the plastic cup and leave to soak for 24 hours. This will ensure that the wick is completely hydrated. Hydrating the probe before first use and every 30 days in KCL solution improves the reading response speed of the pH pen. Never use distilled RO, reverse osmosis, or deionized water to hydrate or store the pH pen. Pure water like these changes the chemistry in the reference, causing the probe to die. Press the power button to turn on. This pen is backlit and has a hold feature for easy reading. One short press of the on-off button to make it hold and once again to turn it off. You can change your Celsius to Fahrenheit by holding the units button down until it starts to flash, then press again to change. pH probes are blown glass and are fragile. When calibrating, always use plastic cups. Glass shot glasses can increase the risk of breaking the pH probe. Now you're ready to calibrate. Place your pen in freshly poured Blue Lab pH 7.0 calibration solution. Wait until the meter stabilizes. This may take a minute or two. Once the reading has stopped moving for at least 30 seconds, with the pen in the 7.0 solution, hold the cal button down until it says CAL on the screen. Remove and rinse in clean tap water. Next, place the pH pen in freshly poured Blue Lab pH 4.0 calibration solution. Wait for the reading to stabilize at least a minute or two. Ah, 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 not too early. You may get an error message. Once the reading has stopped moving with the pen in the 4.0 solution, hold the cal button down until the display reads CAL. Release the button and wait till it reads 4.0. A check mark will appear on your screen to tell you your calibration has been successful. Correct pen storage is easy. Add three to five drops of Blue Lab PH Pro KCL storage solution to the round hole of the storage cap. This will keep the probe tip wet. You will need to add KCL storage solution to the cap every week. There is only one way the cap can go on the pen. Remember, flat side at front, strap at back. Check and place correctly. Storage of your Blue Lab pH pen is simple. Before storing your pen, give it a quick rinse and clean tap water. The cap should have a small sponge in it already. Add three to five drops of Blue Lab pH Pro KCL storage solution to the round hole of the storage cap. Never use or store a pH probe in RO water, deionized, or distilled water. To maximize the performance and life of your pH pen, Blue Lab recommends these easy care steps. If you don't use your pH pen often, keep it upright in a plastic container with Blue Lab pH probe KCL storage solution covering the probe tip. Clean, hydrate, and calibrate your pH pen each month. A good time to do this is when the Cal check mark disappears from the screen. We at Blue Lab hope you enjoy your pH pen. Special features of our pen, backlit LCD display, hold reading function, low battery warning on screen, waterproof pen, successful calibration indicator, double junction probe, auto turn off function, automatic temperature compensation, guarantee for one year from date of purchase. 